Here we are in the vineyard called I Gabbioni, the Great Cages, which was planted in 1985 with Sangiovese grape vines, and today there are approximately 5,000 plants per hectare. Several top wines are produced from these vines at our vineyard. The grape harvest is rigorously carried out by hand in order to safeguard the quality of the grapes and therefore the wine. As you can see, the harvesters check each bunch to see if there are any imperfect ones which are then removed in order to make the first qualitative selection here in the vineyard. In the vineyard Orto del Dori, Dori's garden, the grapes are also Sangiovese, but of a different type to those preceding. Here we have 6,500 vines per hectare, which were planted in 2005. Three quarters of the vineyards are of Sangiovese, this type being the most grown in the Chianti region. Then there are those of Cabernet, Merlot and the Whites. These grapes represent the expression of the territory. The relationship between wine and territory is essential. And also in the choice of grape, it is essential to respect the territory. That is climate, earth, countryside and environment. And these vineyards are the expression of the Chianti territory. The vines need to be very carefully cared for all year round and a special pruning system is used which produces less grapes but an extremely high quality fruit. After the arrival of the grapes, the fruit is put into the hopper, which we can now see, and fermentation begins at a temperature of between 25 and 28 degrees centigrade. Thanks to the control panel, we can follow the fermentation, and in this way we are able to maintain the fermentation temperature at a constant 25 to 28 degrees, which otherwise could rise notably. In each hopper, there is a different type of grape. The Sangiovese grapes are separate from the Merlot grapes, etc. The fermentation process lasts for two to three weeks, and during this time, we check the sugar content, which is found in the liquid. When the alcoholic fermentation has finished, the liquid is transferred to another hopper and the mark is put into a press. After being pressed to extract all the liquid, the skins are sent to a distillery to make grappa. When the fermentation is finished, the wine from the best of the grapes, Sangiovese, Cabernet and Merlot, which are selected to make the best wines, are put in casks made of French oak where they remain for a year. During this period, analytical tests are carried out on the wine in order to avoid any eventual defects. The combination of the wine with the wood of the casks is very important because during the aging process, the wood gives out particular aromas, imparting different flavors to the wines. The casks have a life of no more than three or four years after which they must be changed, because as time passes, the wood becomes less efficacious. The first product we would like to present is Sole Luna, an IGT Tuscan White, 
produced prevalently from Chardonnay grapes at our vineyard. Meridius is a red wine made from a blend of red grapes, mainly Sangiovese, but not matured in casks. Chianti Colli Fiorentini Doc G is our most important product, made prevalently from Sangiovese grapes with a minimal part of Cabernet and Colorino. It is matured in steel vats and then for three months in French oak casks. The Chianti Colli Fiorentini Reserva Doc G is put into casks for six months and then rests for a further three months after being bottled. The two wines in cone-shaped bottles with a special crown cap are the main products of the vineyard. One is Villa San Lorenzo and the other Magliano. Magliano is a blend of Sangiovese, Cabernet Sauvignon and Merlot. It is matured for a year in French oak and then rests for a further six months after being bottled. Villa San Lorenzo is a wine produced exclusively from Sangiovese grapes. It is matured for a year in French oak and then rests for a further six months after bottling. These two wines, which are recognized internationally, are the super of Tuscany, which Lettore wishes to present at the highest level. The Bru Rosé Spumante is something new, which is produced from our Sangiovese grapes. It is excellent as an aperitif, but may also accompany each course throughout any main meal. We also offer French champagne, because it is of a very high quality. Of the two types of the Chianti Grappa, one is a Reserva, matured in casks, and the other by year. Binsanto is a dessert wine which is made from semi-dried grapes from the Tuscan Trebbiano. The winemaking process begins in small oak casks, where it remains for a minimum of three years to ferment and mature, favoured by the passing of the seasons and the alternation of their warmth and cold.